Hi everyone, my name is Alex. If you're new to my channel, welcome, and if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. Today, I'm going to be trying the Inky List Madagascar Side Mask. This product retails for $10. So this is a fairly new product that the Inky List has released, and I'm very excited to try it because it is a little bit of a different product than anything else that I've tried on this channel. From what the Inky List describes, this is a situational kind of item that you use whenever your skin is stressed. It's supposed to restore your skin barrier and help relieve stressed skin, so that's amazing. This product is vegan, cruelty-free, alcohol-free, fragrance free and comes in recyclable packaging. Some of the key ingredients in this product include 1% polyfructal plus, 0.1% frescolate, and 0.2% sim relief. To learn more about these ingredients and to check out the full ingredient list, make sure you click the link in the description to go to the Inky List website. Now the Inky List only recommends using this product once to twice a week, so I definitely feel like that this is something that I will use either after I get back from a trip and my skin is like really destroyed. My skin like goes through it after a long day, especially changing your environment. It kind of like stresses my skin out. And also during the weekend is when I like to do my very restorative kind of skincare routine. So I definitely feel like this is a product that's going to be something I use on the weekend. After a long week of college and work, I need it. The only thing that I'm really specifically looking for with this product is just to see what it does to my skin. Just a basic review of this skincare product. Since it is a little bit different of a product, there's nothing really specific that I'm looking for except for that. I will let you all know what I noticed. I usually don't use MAC during the week because I don't really have time. So I feel like taking 15 minutes out of my skincare routine just to relax and fully enjoy this product, I feel like that's going to be very good for not just my skin, but my mental health as well. Anyway, I will check in and probably let you all know how it goes when I use this product. I will see you all in the next check-in. Hi everyone, this is very weird. <laughs> I have the mask on right now. I just applied it and I have to say there is an extreme cooling sensation going on on my face, but it's like very relaxing. I feel like it's going to be very therapeutic for me. I feel like it's going to be very good, not just for my skin, but also for my mental health. It feels amazing. It's extremely cooling. The only thing I'm not the biggest fan of is the smell. It's not the worst. The smell does go away. Like I don't smell it, but at first it was like, whoa, but it is very thin. I used glycolic acid before putting this mask on, so having this on actually feels really good. I'm going to check in afterwards and just kind of let you all know how I feel after everything's done. So far, I'm really liking it. I think they said you can leave it like on for extra hydration. I am going to wash it off and treat it like a mask. I will let you all know how I feel afterwards, so I will see you all in the next check-in. Hi everyone, I rinsed the mask off and I put on my moisturizer and all my other serums when they said instant relief they meant it when I tell you my skin was so stressed out like it was going through it because of the glycolic acid that I used the second that I put that mask on and rinsed it off after waiting 10 minutes my face felt really good I usually would be having sensitivity from the glycolic acid that I used my skin right now feels so hydrated and amazing and it looks good too I'm very happy with how it looks I'm going to use this for a couple Couple more times I'll check in if I notice anything else if not I'll come back with my final thoughts I really so far am feeling like this is going to be an amazing situational item in my skincare routine like when my skin is stressed I will see you all in the next check-in Hi everyone, I am back to give you all my final thoughts on this product. Let me go ahead and dive into some of the things that I found out during this trial. So I just first want to start out by saying that I absolutely love this mask. I feel like it's a good thing for not just my skin's health, but my mental health as well. It's very soothing to your skin. Like I said during my check-in, I had used glycolic acid that night, and that is an active that I struggle with along with retinol with sensitivity. This mask really helped to calm that down. I didn't feel any sensitivity while using that product after using this mask and I woke up the next morning and my face felt amazing. I truly did not find anything negative with this mask. I actually did find out that if you stick this in the refrigerator and you apply it on your face it feels like 
10 times better. I don't know what it is with me. I'm going through an obsession right now of sticking skincare products in the refrigerator. I really like this product as a self-care product and sticking it in the refrigerator just enhances that experience. I would 100% recommend trying this product, especially if you struggle with sensitivity. This mask was so soothing and I have absolutely nothing negative to say about this product. I think it's a great product and the Inky List did amazing with this. I can't wait to keep using it and see the long-term benefits on my skin barrier. But I notice a major reduction in sensitivity and redness with the first time using this product. But yeah, anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this review. If you did, make sure you subscribe because I post new videos every week and I will see you all in the next review. Bye!